Here's NBC's Jay Gray. As gunfire rings out, gunfire, gunfire. party quickly shifts to pandemonium along 6th Street in Austin. The EMS know we're in a We need more units. We need a lot more units out here for control. A crowd of innocent bystanders caught in the crossfire during a shootout between at least two people in the entertainment district. A 25-year-old tourist killed and 13 people injured. Our aggravated assault and homicide unit detectives are out here investigating at this time, uh, as well as members of our organized crime and our gang units uh, to, from that perspective, to see if this incident was gang related or what other type of motive there might have been in this shooting incident. It's not clear at this point what sparked this off. Okay, watch out. Three people are dead, five wounded after weekend shootings in Dallas-Fort Worth. Among those injured, a four-year-old girl who was hit by gunfire during what police say was a disturbance between two groups at a southeast Dallas apartment complex. Yeah, and checking late this afternoon, that little four-year-old expected to fully recover. We also now know that at least two people have been arrested in the Austin shooting over the weekend. Shep, one other note, the violence here in the Dallas-Fort Worth area moving to the road raid, to the roadways with road rage. Dallas police now telling us they're stepping up their patrols on the highways in and around the city because of that problem. Jay Gray, thank you. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.